Hello and welcome to another Top Tips video. My name is Chris Robertson and I am a brass tutor for YourSpaceMusicLessons.com. Now, in this video, we're going to talk about how do we make a sound on a brass instrument. So here I have a euphonium and all the different parts of the mouthpiece. We have the bell, which basically just acts as a big amplifier for everything we do in the mouthpiece. And really simply, three valves up here, one valve here, and a load of tuning slides. Now, I spoke about this being the amplifier, but this is what we need to amplify. And to make a sound on a brass instrument, we have to do a technique that we call buzzing. Now, without a buzz, we have no sound. And to buzz, we use a thing called our embouchure, which is a really fancy word for just the way we move our mouth to play brass and wind instruments. Now, all we have to do is purse our lips together and it's as if we're gonna be blowing a raspberry. So without the mouthpiece, it looks and sounds like this. And with, it's like this. Now, the euphonium is a low brass instrument. So when I buzz a note, my lips have quite a big gap in between them. But if you were to play a high brass instrument, like a cornet or a trumpet, you would have to have a smaller gap in your mouth, which we call the aperture. Now I have a cornet mouthpiece here, and to play the cornet, you need a higher sound on the buzz, so it might sound like this. And to play higher and lower, all we have to do is tighten and relax the muscles in our mouth to play higher and lower notes. Now, once you can make this sound on a mouthpiece, you are ready to play your first note. So we pop it in the instrument and we take a big breath as always and we blow that raspberry. Now, for anyone who would want to try to learn one of these brass instruments, you can get started by just using a mouthpiece. Whether you're in the car or walking to school or walking the dog in the park, you don't need the instrument on you to practice and to learn these, these instruments. So all you have to do is you could be walking along the street and you can be listening to music and you could, you could play along to your favorite song on the TV or on the radio. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you for the next Top Tips video.